Comparison is the death of joy. Mark Twain. I had really smart friends in high school. They were the nerds even the nerds wouldn't sit with. Our old group now consists of two doctors, one chemical engineer, one lawyer, and one successful businessman. In case you were keeping track, I am none of those things yet. I had another group of friends too. The kids I helped pass high school. They were the cool, normal kids. Using Facebook as my main source of stalking, none of them became doctors or lawyers. A few of them had kids. Most of them still live in the area. It was always a competition with the first group. What grades we got, how we did on the SAT or ACT, what colleges we were applying to. The only competition I had with the second group was how many fries we could fit in our mouths. Well over 30 if you're curious. The first group taught me to be ambitious, to push myself to see how far I could go in life. The second group taught me that there's more to life than seeing how far you can go. One group has fancy framed papers on their walls. The other group is already building photo albums of their little ones. The problem with comparing yourself to others is that you are living two different stories. Neither of you began in the same place, or were born with the same gifts. The best analogy is lasagna versus chili, because the best analogies are always food related. Lasagna requires noodles, sauce, cheese, maybe some veggies and meat. Chili is a completely different recipe. Meat, beans, tomato paste, corn, peppers. If you set a bowl of each in front of a person and ask them which tasted better, that would be completely dependent on what they were in the mood for. You are not better than them because you were baked in an oven, and they are not better than you for having sweet corn mixed in. The point is, there is nothing to gain by being better than someone else. The only true progress in life comes from being better than who you were yesterday. I love my friends. All of them. I love them despite their accomplishments and because of their mistakes.